Gonna hop on the ferry boat today because it's someone's birthday. Good morning, monorail. And it's not Mike. It's not your birthday. <laughs> it's not my birthday. It's not your birthday. Today. Yeah, someone's birthday is today. That's right. It's the Magic Kingdom's 53rd birthday. Crazy. Happy birthday, Magic Kingdom. Let's take a closer look. For the birthday, we're gonna we're gonna eat here at Casey's Corner. I've actually never seen them open this, and I want to see that little opening ceremony here. They open up in just about five minutes. And there goes the double decker. All right, here it is. This is how they open it. first people in Casey's this morning. Oh, it's been a minute since I've been here and I forget how much I do love the theming in here. They do have some famous dogs. Let's eat. This is what they have for Halloween. Different uh, Chipotle barbecue dogs, street corn. It's definitely a thing on the menu this year. But I just went for the number one, the, the regular chili cheese. Actually, I went for the foot long, not regular. The, the chili cheese hot dog. Casey at the back. I think that's on Disney Plus. You know, honestly, this wasn't in my uh, my mind this morning. The uh, <laughs> the thought of getting Casey's, but here we go. Ridiculous. Breakfast of champions. Yes, it is. Yeah, man, and the cheese sauce. <laughs> cheese sauce. And we got the views of that 53-year-old right there. This is insane. How much cheese and chili and dog <laughs> is on this? How are you doing over here with the? See what you gotta do? You take a mini corn dog. Yeah. You get some cheese sauce in there. Cheese sauce. Mm -hmm. And then you stuff. And then you stuff. So good. And the Dapper Dan's going by on the the horse-drawn carriage. Lunch was so good. Kind of too much. I threw away more than I ate, but that's okay. We're gonna continue the day and see what happens. Is that Wendell? Hi! It's great to see you. I didn't recognize you with the new, uh, the new outfit. It's been a minute. Great to see you. Great to see you. We're gonna go watch the, uh, <laughs> the, the we're gonna do the Haunted Mansion. Yeah, we're gonna go see some ghosts. Gonna do a, an opening day attraction here, the Haunted Mansion. And it's only a 20 minute wait. And the weather's starting to look like it's uh, trying to fit in. Feels so good in here. It's ridiculously hot today. It's supposed to be in October. But I love that we're getting to ride Haunted Mansion. It was not a long wait. 
They didn't even have any, um, an actual queue open, like the extended queue in the cemetery. Man, he's starting to change, isn't he? Dude, starting to look a little older. He was nice and young looking when we first got here, but now he's going. Wow, he's still getting older. Am I the only one seeing this? There's an aura of foreboding, almost as though you sense a disquieting metamorphosis. Is this haunted room actually stretching? Well, we made it on, but we're stopped again. Playful spooks have interrupted our tour. The motion immediately. Remain seated in your doom buggy. We will continue our tour in just a moment. Here we go. <laughs> Donald Duck chair. See Donald Duck's face on there? That's one of my favorites right there. I love that. The ghost playing the piano. And here comes the, the hat box ghost. We're gonna get him transforming back, probably. Nope, he's just hanging out. Weird, didn't transform. This is classic right here to me, classic Haunted Mansion. Some more uh, portraits over there, including the Hatbox Ghost, right there in the middle. Oh no, we're going by. Madame Leota's having a there we go. See the ghost pretty good today. Is the hidden Mickey down there still there? Let's see. No, I think they moved it. Oh yeah, ghosts are definitely out today. The Rolly Crump wilted wax man right there. Ah, got him. This is my favorite part of the whole ride. The graveyard scene. Love this scene. You guys seen some stuff. I just love this. And today being October 1st, it's just a little fitting that we would be hanging out in a graveyard during a swinging wake. One of my favorite months of the year. Sing it, fellas. Hey, we've stopped right here. This is cool. All right. You got it. <laughs> this is awesome. It's one of my favorite scenes, and I get to be stuck right here in the middle of it. You see all the animatronics. So cool. Man, if only the uh, the doors, I mean, the, if only the lights would turn on, that'd be cool. But we're getting to see the uh, the bust, the singing bust here. Well, there's the audio. Yeah, that was fun. Either way, I wish we would have gotten stuck right here so we could see more. But, uh, you know. There is a hidden Mickey inside this mausoleum. He's like holding a hidden Mickey in his hand. It's hard to see, but there you go. And these hitchhiking ghosts, they'll follow us home. Mike, which one are we getting? He's sitting on my, my he's sitting on my shoulders. Wait, he switched our, oh, he switched our heads. Well, we did it. An opening day classic, the Haunted Mansion, so much fun. What a fun day so far, 53rd anniversary of Magic Kingdom. Gonna head over to Tomorrowland. And just think, Mike, 
Back in 1971, you'd walk over here and you would see the little Nautilus going around 20,000 leagues under the sea. One of my favorite opening day attractions right here, the Speedway. I always think of Buddy Hackett out here with Herbie the Love Bug. And since it's the opening day, we're doing it. Tomorrowland Speedway, we're doing it. So this uh, is not what it looked like in 1971. There was like no people mover built over here in the ceremony. You could not see any of the Space Mountain, obviously Tron. The only thing you could see over here was the, the pathway, the speedway, and the contemporary. Why has it changed in over 50 years? But I always love a reason to ride on Victory Circle. So let's do it. All right, we're in. Here we go. What it's like to drive in Britain. Yeah, you're on the opposite <laughs> side there. Here we go. You can't bump. No bumping. But okay, so opening day ceremony. Buddy Hackett was out here with a bunch of other uh, uh, race car drivers, and he had Herbie the Love Bug out here. Really? Yeah, on the opening day special with Julie Andrews, and that's what I feel like we're doing right now. Where's Hoibie? We Where's Hoibie? Hoibie. They should bring that back. They should bring Herbie on here. That'd be awesome. There you go. Tomorrowland Speedway. Space Mountain wasn't here. And I don't think in the opening day ceremony, uh, Tomorrowland was really complete with the, the people mover. So none of this was here. How did y'all split? How did you switch lanes? Obviously, Tron wasn't here. How do we get in the fast lane? How do we get in the life in the fast lane? <laughs> Whoa! We almost hit them. They almost hit us. Oh, we're getting close. It's all right, we're on a track. Nothing we're... bad can happen. You say that. Totally safe. Totally safe. Hey, we're going under the bridge. I love a good bridge. The bridge! <laughs> There's the castle in all its beauty. I got it. I know. <laughs> this is like parts of Walt Disney World that most people don't see. <laughs> Did you lose your phone lost there? Lost it. Or you, 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 you need two you, hands for this one. You're filming on the speedway. You got to have two hands. Here, I'll drive. There you you can grab your thing and, and you then we'll. Go. There we go. See, I got it. I got it, Mike. Do Don't worry. Ride. Hey, there's Space Mountain. It's Tron. Tron. This should be a new thing they offer: a ride with Micah. A ride with me? <laughs> Yo, I want this guy's job. Oh, I'm sorry. I let go. I want some water. Stop off and get a drink. Yeah, we stop off. Step out and get a drink there real quick. An in-depth review of Magic Kingdom. Look at that. All right. Look at the views, Mike. Oh, hey, we're going over the bridge we went under. Right here. Here we go. We're starting to pick up speed. We now. are. We're going downhill a little bit. Whoa. A little, uh, little, little there bumpy there. Oh, a little, 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 little oh, bumpy oh, back oh. there. I know, I wonder if like they ever, well, the, the track's like completely stuck to the ground. But oh man, you can see the track right there, it's crazy. We're almost back to the, uh, the finish line here. There's pit row. And I wonder, back in the day, I don't remember, but all of this was Mickey's birthday land and then Mickey's star land and all that. Could you see like Donald and, and Goofy's house right here? Or was this all like blocked off with the facades and everything? Still getting used to Dumbo, believe it or not, being over here. Dumbo used to be right behind the castle next to the Friar's Nook. This was fun. The only thing that I, I gripe about with this one is it's too open. It needs some tree coverage yeah. like Disneyland's. Disneyland's has all those little paths with trees and they didn't think about this. 1971. Out nope, not really. Anybody was uh, building theme parks in in Florida, the Sunshine State. This was fun. We did it. Well, we're on another form of uh, transportation here, Mike. This is the people mover. Famous. World famous people mover. Stop service yeah. around Tomorrowland. Around Tomorrowland. TTA Blue Line is what they call it now. The Tomorrowland Transit Authority is what TTA stands for. 
travelers, welcome aboard the Still getting used to the, uh, the, new, the new voiceover, too. Your guide aboard this highway in the sky. But this ride will never get old to me. A little lackluster of a day, though, I will say, for the celebration. There was no announcement, no special park map or anything. I had my own fun, though. But it's hard to think, Mike. Right up here, you'll see the original plans for Walt Disney's Progress City. And this is what we were supposed to have. And a lot of the visionary ideas throughout Walt Disney World. Look, there's even a tiny people mover. There is. I wonder if that's like right there. See it? That was a fun ride though on the Tomorrowland Speedway. It's been a hot minute since now I've actually ridden the ride. And light cycle run. I love a good circuit. And I do too. I do too. For a bit of light it's a fun ride. Same with uh, Tron. I rode that a couple of weeks ago. My family was in town and Abby and I rode. It was super fun. Alright Mike, last time I was here, the lights were on. This is Star Wars. I don't think they're on this time. Or as we locals call it, space. I was thought we were gonna go launch off. Launch off? Yeah, like, like you're riding space, space Mountain. No, I rode this uh, about two weeks ago, my mom and the lights were on and I filmed it. I'm gonna throw that footage in right now. This is what it looks like regular. It smells like Space Mountain in here. And then here it is with the lights on. Holy cow. These lights are on. light tunnel. A little different with the lights on, I will say. Thank you. Yeah, this is like to your right, not original. Uh, the facade over here, you wouldn't see any of this stuff. You can see the contemporary, like I said earlier, and right above the bathroom here, that was where the, uh, the Skyliner, that was where the Skyway buckets sat. You would walk up there and that was where you would get on the Skyway buckets. So, right over here, all of this, just imagine it just being cleared out grass and you can see the, the contemporary resort straight ahead. The next station is it's pretty wild how much has changed As usual, since 1971. There's a lot of people out in front of that castle though watching the show. Well, the, we were going to hop on the vehicle, but it's currently taking off. Happy birthday, Magic Kingdom, Cinderella Castle. Happy birthday. Here's to another 53 years. I was not going to forget Walt either. I had to stop over here and see Walt and Mickey. He never got to see this dream come to fruition, but I feel like if he did, he'd be, he'd be proud of his brother Roy. And of course, I've got to say hello to the man, Roy. If it wasn't for this man, we wouldn't be here today. That's hot. Oh my God. <laughs> That's hot. Man, You're, he's smoking. <laughs> he's so hot. If it wasn't for this man, we wouldn't be here today. Yeah. <laughs> it's hot. Yeah, I meant to check on the way in to see if it was anything special and it's still Tiana. 
And with that, it's time to say goodbye, and I will see you on the next episode. Until then, happy birthday, Magic Kingdom. Stay weird. Goodbye.